Last summer, we ranked in the top five most dangerous cities to live. After last night's incident, this city has reached a record number of homicides within a span of seven days. This is unacceptable. We deserve to feel safe in our community. Young girls like Asia and her family will no longer fall victim to these senseless crimes. We've been separated from each other for too long. I listened to the stories and heard the complaints. The people are fed up and more determined than ever to get us all on the same page and work towards the progress we so desperately need. I'm counting on the people to come together as one to build a better city and to let me be your liaison that sheds the guiding light through these tough times, through optimism, through collaboration, and most of all, through communication, our city will rise and flourish again. Hi, I'm James. I'm Quinn. I'm Joanne. I'm Charles. I'm Erin. I'm Barack. And we are the students of the University at Buffalo's Media Study Department. About a year ago, I had the honor of working on a film with a group of students from Buffalo and Binghamton as they tried to bridge the gap between the two areas. Now, not only are we trying to pick up where they left off, but we're trying to raise the bar in terms of production for the Buffalo Niagara area. With the help of two well-known filmmakers in Buffalo, Vinny and the Crom, and the help of the co-director of the Buffalo Creative Arts Initiative, Bruce Jackson, we plan on merging our resources of talent by giving students and alumni the opportunity to create and explore their passions. We're gonna be safe, that's one thing. <laughs> our project is titled Lone Stars, and our goal is to create a world that provides an accurate and unbiased depiction of our current social climate. The intertwined stories of our two main characters, Cameron and Joaquin, shows them trying to pull their lives together as they unwillingly travel down a path of disarray and destruction in the process. It's a story that is the reality of many young African Americans today. It's about learning that the right and the wrong path can lead to the same destination. It asks the question, when do you give up hope? Two characters who are seemingly so different, both just trying to survive the only way they know how. Not only are we trying to create a cinematic and eye-opening project, we also want to maintain the resources and networks that we create during this project, as well as pave the way for students and young filmmakers. But in order for our production to go smoothly, or be feasible for that matter, we need funds to compensate the work of more than 25 actors, as well as secure filming equipment and locations over several days of shooting. With such an ambitious project, we need some help. As we all know, creating costs money, so we're asking whatever you can spare will be greatly appreciated. We promise to make you guys an amazing product that will hopefully bring clarity and insight to a socially changing time. We'll see you soon, and thank you for all your contributions.